So, just take a look at that movement again, and then I'll break it down further for you. All right? I'll put his hands on the floor, his arms too far away, so I go and get him. Alright? Right, now, if you want to refine the movement further, looking at what I do with my feet, yeah? So it's not. Stepping. Because every time I take my foot off the floor, my body is going from side to side like this and losing balance and my core has to work harder. And it's just harder when you've got someone on top of you, it makes it really difficult. So what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to bring some consistency to my movement as I'm, as I'm going backwards. So I do my bridge here like this. I have my arm up. What I do with my feet, and you can do this almost any time, but especially underneath the mount, is to drag my foot. So I don't lose connection with the floor at all. Yeah. Right? So if I'm here like this and I've bridged, and I'm on, let's say I'm on one shoulder, as soon as I take a foot off the ground, that happens. Yeah? And it's going to happen to both sides, right? Because I'm here and I step and I go into the other shoulder and then I go to take, take my foot off and then I fall to that side. And that's going to be happening on a, on a small scale the whole time you're doing it. But it's going to make it really difficult when you've got a big person on top of you, right? So just try and make it easy for yourself so that when you bridge the person up and you go to get their arm, I'm sliding my feet along the floor. Yeah, and when I'm doing it, I obviously don't want to put to weight until my foot's way back there before I do anything to bring it back again. So each person will have a slightly different track or gait to their movement based on your leg length, like this. So as you're moving, you're staying connected to the floor. Yeah, so do exactly the same thing, but pay special attention to your feet making sure that you're not stepping, yeah, right? Because every step is an opportunity for your, your, your opponent to, to counter your movement, yeah? 23.